What we're going to demonstrate now or show, which has been done in the previous experiments, we have you can produce nanomaterial in any shape or form you like. This is most probably the longest nanotube ever seen. What in reality is, these are, this is a telephone cable with usually seven different electrodes, cable, smaller cables, color cables inside it, mm -hmm. which each cable, small wire in a way, carries seven copper wires mm -hmm. internally. Well, we've done some, moves, which is very easy to do now. We place this copper, which is covered with the initial plastic of the wire, and then the external cable wire, or plastic cable plastic, in a reactor like this. And after a given time, what happens is that if you take the electrode out, one of these copper lines out, what we will see is that the seven cables or seven wires inside the one of the copper color little wires are totally black. This is the color they used to be originally, copper color. But now, but now they are totally <coughs> black. So they are covered with uh, nanomaterial. They are covered with nanomaterial. Even even if they are in the isolated. Uh even they are in a plastic coating of the wire, which is already in the cover of the plastic cable. Yeah. And we know this material is uh, totally uh, <coughs> nano layer because one of the properties of nanomaterial is that it is not conductive. So, to prove that the whole thing is correct, or the wires are literally why they are in this jacket are totally insulated from each other. So, we can demonstrate it very easy. How easy can be made? Uh, and in reality, we make as much as we like. Any shape, any size. These are the high tension aluminium used for high tension cables. If we use the same meter and show the resistance of let's say 2000 K ohms This can be seen the same, it's totally insulated. Mm -hmm. The copper coating will not allow the aluminium oxide nano layer will not allow the connections. It's very interesting because you can see it. So what it means with this method you can literally reduce the size of a telephone cable to a single line. Yeah. And then this has application in medical purposes where as we shown that each wire is separated totally individually, where the nerves are cut, this considering this to be like a spine nerve system, where the spine is cut, or where in the case of MS, the coating of the nerve has gone, we can recoat the, the nerves and allow the person to live a normal life. This is why the medical trials of the technology are going on and they are so successful because we understand this concept very well. To show the total insulation of the wires from each other, 
we have taken two wires out of the one of these small wires out we have to sandpaper it because it's actually diamond structure and if we take the battery and we take a Christmas light I think we move slightly to the side that way you can see it much easier this is the battery and that's a Christmas light Okay, which shows that the light is working. Yeah, so that's normal, normal Christmas battery light. connected with normal mm -hmm. connector. Oh, right. Okay. In reality, these two copper wires, which have been taken out of one of these telephone lines yeah. and twisted to each other, if they can connect these two lines together and bring the light back to working, it means the coating of nano layer on the copper wire is hundred percent and it shows that production of the nano material is correct. And there's only just two hands here we try to see to find the best way to demonstrate this. That will have the best results. Or if we can get a connection. What I do So instead of having a short circuit, I'm blowing the fuse out. Yeah. The battery, the two wires, are allowing the connections. Yes. So, so each of them is separate from each other, isolated. So we have shown for the first time that nano material can be used to reduce the size of cable. Yeah. We can show that nanomaterials can be used to create insulation and even in production for layers in microchip. So you do not need expensive apparatus and radiation material to create one of the simplest materials in the world which is in the, in the universe which is atomic carbon. And all we do we separate it from the carbon components of the the cola was 